Hi, I'm Kurt Theobald. I'm a segmented wood turner. I've put this video together to help you more clearly understand the process that I went through to create this segmented turning. We're going to the workshop to look at the blueprint that I've drawn to see the step-by-step -step procedure that I used to create this bowl. According to the drawing between the base of the bowl and the first segmented ring, there's a veneer separation. Now when you cut your veneer, make sure that it's wider than the base of the bowl. The reason for that is I always like to put some masking tape across the ingrain of the veneer and the reason for doing that is to keep the veneer from splitting during the gluing process. Now be careful because you're sanding on the uphill and the downhill side. You can see the glaze spots that's showing on the screen here, here, haven't been sanded yet. Now over here we have sanded spots, so we need to make it all a consistent sanded surface. 